Hi guys, so welcome back to my YouTube channel. I'm finally restarting my YouTube channel. I know I was not regular at all because I got busy with other work. I got married. I had to shift a home, and uh, it just it was just a lot. And uh, I was just busy with keeping up with my blog and Instagram. I completely forgot about YouTube, but I want to come back full time. I promise. And um, today I have for you Zara haul. These are all the items that I shopped during the sale season. Okay, so um, I started with ordering a um, few items for the first time. Then I went back and ordered again and again and again and again. And in total, I have five orders here. Don't judge me, guys. Okay, the Zara sale was that good. <laughs> Actually. It was not as good as it used to be, I feel. Um, but yeah, it, it, it was good. It was good. I I can't complain. I have five packages here, so uh, let's just quickly dive into it. And uh, the first package that I have here, okay, these are these are not in the order of um, the purchases that I made. These are just kept size-wise. <laughs> the biggest boxes are down there, which was actually my first and second purchase, and. Um, I don't remember the prices honestly right now, so I'm just gonna read out if if there's a tag on the piece, then I'm gonna read it out and I'm gonna put pictures somewhere here or here, and um, I'm gonna sort of put a model shot, the price before and after, and I don't, um, I'm not so sure how much I spent, but I think I spent somewhere around I don't know. Uh, we'll see, we'll see in the end. Okay, so first thing is. Okay, so I uh, have been really regular to gym, and I'm so proud of myself because I've lost a lot, and um, I feel like I'm finally getting, uh, you know, into that shape where I can wear bodycon dresses because I've completely stopped wearing bodycon dresses. So this is the first bodycon dress that I got. It is so pretty. I, I love the color. I mean, like my husband was not so sure in the beginning. He was like, ah, green. I don't know, but. This looks really, really fashion forward and such a bold color. And I, these days I'm really into bright colors. Like uh, just the pictures come out so much better with bright colors. And although I'm a very classic person, but I don't know. Lately I've just started loving colors. I think it's it's the summers. It's mainly during the summers because in winters I am mostly gravitating towards darker colors. Like of course. So yeah, this is the first piece. It's a bodycon dress. It's a midi length and. If you guys know me, you know that I love midi length. Okay, so the next dress is also a midi dress, and this is the dress. It's really uh, pretty, and what I really liked about this dress was that it had a very uh, 60s vibe. Um, the whole length and the fall of it it's a very straight uh, dress the whole cut of it i think it looks very um, i don't know how to put it a, a very uh, art deco uh, sort of vibe it has so that's why i really liked it so that's why i picked it up and i really love the material that it has it's like a boucle i don't know it's like a mesh mesh material with a lining inside so i really like that okay Next, I have I don't know what I have. Okay, so this was actually my last purchase. I was just uh, going through the website again out of habit, and I noticed few things were uh, new in the sale season. I mean, like if you're shopping on Zara, you would know that as uh, they sort of keep introducing new items during the sale. Like if you shopped once, um, you are probably missing out on a lot. So keep going back till the sale is gone, and I'm sure you'll find something really nice. So these pants I found. On my last visit to Zara, and oh my god, and everything has been bought online. I cannot deal with the store during the sale season. It's just too hot, humid, and the crowd. It just gets really messy. So I prefer shopping online. And um, the Zara return policy is so good that you know it's just shopping online is just better. And these pants are so nice. They're high waisted. They're very like loose fitting and very casual. But with high heels, and I feel like bralettes or maybe a crop top and even a blazer, it will look so 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 hot. So that is why I got it, and I love the color. This is it's like a rusty orange color, and it's absolutely gorgeous. Now we pull that up, and next thing is something that I had been uh, planning on getting for the longest time, but since I was not that fit, I was not able to pick one up. It's a satin skirt, basically. It's a very basic midi-length satin skirt in black color, as basic as it can get. Uh, this now looks so good on me. I'm so glad. And I, 
I genuinely thought that I'm ordering this, but I'll try it on. I'll not like it. I'll probably end up returning it, but I did like it and I love it and I'm keeping it. So that's that. And then the next thing, okay. So this is like a very basic ribbed material, uh, deep neck, we cut tank top. And I don't know, I just feel like I love stocking up on basics but stylish basics like i really love the cut that it has the deep v cut both front and back it just adds some extra element to the regular tank tops you know like the simple round neck tank tops so that's why i picked that up because i'm all about basics and uh, if you have your basics right i don't think you can ever say that you know i don't have anything to wear because if you have your basics you just pull up one high-waisted trousers one tank top and you're good to go you know so i feel like basics is something and i think i can do a video also you know telling you guys what kind of basics you should stock up on so that you never run out of outfits you can like sort of mix and match and always create a whole new look with the right basics next is this dress i haven't tried it on i think i should because i tried everything else on except for this dress because it had so many buttons and long nails they don't gel well together so that's why i haven't tried it on but i think i should because it doesn't fit me right i have to i might have to return it but i feel like it it, it would fit right because it has a belt that cinches the whole thing together so even if it's a little loose if i like cinch the belt completely tightly so it will look good so yeah and i really like the print it's a very uh cartoonish floral print which is also different than what you see these days and that's why i really like it and i think this is um, perfect for fall or a little bit of uh, colder months also because it's like a darker print and then darker florals look so good during winters then next thing is this dress this is like a t-shirt dress in a very soft fabric and I love the color again mustard is one of my favorite colors and you'll see a lot of items in mustard or yellow because I don't know I'm just feeling bright colors these days and uh, yeah I really love it it's very simple it has a little uh, V if I'm not wrong yeah it's sort of uh, self design but I really like it I'm gonna be out of breath soon because I'm talking so much but that's okay it's a whole video next is again a midi length dress it's a straight dress again and it's in mustard color again and okay so what's really interesting about this dress is it has fringes at the bottom and just looks really different and very chic and very high fashion when you wear it and it's just such a simple yet a very eye-catching dress you can just put on this dress some gold earrings because mustard and gold earrings go so well together so you can just throw that on and you're good to go you know and i love outfits like that you know just put on one piece and you're ready you don't have to think twice about it i'm just throwing cartons after cartons okay this is a big package but um, i don't know how many items are in there but um, i remember my first order being for 10 items and i ended up returning few so i wore this t-shirt for one of my igtv videos not igtv um story videos when i was doing a tutorial of how to do how to wear red lips for a casual day out and i was wearing this little crop top it's crochet top with batwing sleeves and i got so many questions about this top that where is it from it's so chic it's so pretty because you could just see this part and it looked really nice because it was v-neck and it was crochet so yeah it's from zara and on sale and i think it's still available on sale if i'm not wrong you can check it out of course next is okay this is a very basic thing but i had a similar crop top in um, mustard no orange rusty orange color and i saw this in black and that was from forever 21 but this one is so much nicer like it's the same exact same thing but the straps are a um, little thinner and it's in black color so you cannot resist a simple black crop top right you can never like sort of it will always be in fashion and that's the kind of pieces that i love to collect all right so this is a it's so so, so crushed oh my god but you'll see the picture so you'll know how it looks it's like a very chic shirt and you know it's the kind I, I love the color that's why i picked it up it came in two three different three, three different colors this one emerald green there was one ruby red and there was one more i think white and i was leaning towards white but i figured i have a lot of white shirts it just looks very formal so i picked this color which is a little festive uh would be perfect to you know wear to dinner with uh, my in-laws or maybe my parents um 
All right, so this is a crop top again, and it's black, it's basic, and I got it in two colors. But it was so cheap, and it, the details, oh my god, okay. So the um, neckline is really short, I really need to like struggle to get into it, because I have a big head. And um, these details are so pretty, like uh, it just sits on your neck like a necklace, and looks really, really nice, and very, very chic, because it's, you know, closed neck I usually avoid, because I have a short, uh, short neck and it doesn't really look good on me but this looks so 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 good and i got this in white also that must be in here too okay, yeah, it is. all right so this is um crop top with um crossover front and in mustard yellow i told you guys i am a big fan of this color this season and it's just a really basic crop top like what can i talk about it is it, it's in a satiny fabric it's polyester i think and i don't mind polyester until unless like i am going out of outdoors like out of ac but yeah as far as i'm in ac i'm good and this is again a tank top which i wore out but i put it back in the bag just because i wanted to show you guys so this is a basic tank top it's like a crop top but with a very chic v a uh, deep plunging cut and uh, the uh, sleeves are also like very deep plunging cut and it just looks really chic for some reason i think it's a neck cut and the straps are really thick and i think that is what makes it really really good looking and very like classic piece it's very it has a french vibe to it i think and i got the same thing in um, neon neon green and i think the neon green one was the first one that i got and then i really liked the cut of it and then i noticed that it's available in black as well and i ordered that too i think it was available in white also but i'd already gotten so much white so i had to skip it so the last package which was actually my first order the biggest one yet i'm gonna open this up <laughs> so much and i ended up returning a lot of items i think five five or six items i ended up returning because they were not the right fit or you know there was a really chic really pretty pants but they were medium size and surprisingly i'm small size <laughs> not surprisingly i usually buy small but yeah um, a small was not available so i had to return it then again a white crop top what do you know surprise surprise it's not a detail in the front and that's why i picked it up because throw in one single detailing and i am sold like really this is the neon green top I was actually talking about when I was talking about the black tank top and um, okay I know it's the color is outrageous it's not something I would wear but maybe it is I don't know I really love the color and that's why I picked it up it just the cut was so good and that is why I picked up I think I'm not a big fan of neon color because I just don't think it's my style but you know in the right doses it can really look good I think so uh, next is this t-shirt that my husband was not agreeing with but i always sort of gravitate towards the stripes and this one is a cropped t-shirt and a really loose fit and big neckline and i sort of fell in love with it it looked it looked like something a french person would wear on with a red lipstick and just heading out the door to buy some groceries i don't know it just looked very chic to me I love stripes moving on and we have another black top which is inside out because i wore it for a video <laughs> all right let's quickly fix that and uh, this is a off shoulder top and look at the sleeves the bubble sleeves are so cute and um, it's a crop top again and it's really pretty and that is the only reason i picked up and i have noticed someone wearing this i don't remember who but someone was wearing something similar and i really liked it um, they were wearing with the sleeves up but it did not look that flattering but with the sleeves down completely off shoulder it looked really really nice okay so next is again what do you know a black top it's a structured peplum top and it's very chic i think it's the cut is very neat i'm all about good finishing i mean like these little details they matter a lot to me because i am a designer student and i really get really excited you know when i see such cute little detailings because they just elevate the whole look to another level okay so this top i got solely for the design element of the sleeves this looks really nice and super cute super fashionable and um, the whole top looks like a grown-up 30 plus woman would i'm not 30 plus 
yet <laughs> but uh, somebody 30 plus would wear and immediately look very chic with a low burn and some um, very chic glasses so I'm giving a lot of description here in time this is gonna be a long day why is Aman socks in here he bought socks and sale and maybe a couple of denims yeah two denims both in black color they're both crazy like that <laughs> so um, this is a dress that I picked up really 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 good oh my god this is so soft takes the shape of your body and looks really nice and especially i love the fact that it has this detail in the back how cute this button detailing is like what sold me um it just looks really nice and very um i don't know it gives me a kendall jenner vibe she wears these kind of dresses a lot and uh, I love Kendall so I bought it <laughs> and this can be worn in winters or the colder months as well because it's full sleeves it's nice it's, you can just wear some black tights with it black uh, sheer leggings not leggings it's, and it'll look nice okay so this is a short a pleated uh, ruffled shorts layered ruffles shorts it's not uh, very short but it's not very long it just sits perfectly beneath your hips and it just covers the right amount and looks really really hot and that's why I got it so this is the bag that I got this is the only bag that I picked up um, and I think this is my most prized piece that I picked up during the sale because it's a statement piece it's a bag and it's so chic it's amazing it's amazing I can't wait to wear it <laughs> I love the detailing, the bamboo handles, the thread work, the wool work, I don't know what it is but it's like a crochet work uh, body but it's just really really chic. This is the front, okay. So that was my Zara haul, I don't know how long it was. If you want any more details, I'm sure I must have listed everything like the before price, the after price and the total amount that I spent. I can't calculate now but I'll calculate and put it later here in the video. So this is the amount that I spent in total and I'm absolutely no regrets. I'm proud of it. Like Zara sale is the time when you score good pieces and build your wardrobe again. Um, and I'm really happy because I was getting really bored of my wardrobe and I wanted some change. I wanted some new pieces. If you have any suggestions, any uh, questions and any new video ideas, Please comment below and let me know because I am restarting YouTube. I've got a whole setup done, like the whole shebang, and I plan to do a lot more videos. And I cannot promise, but I am going to try. I'm going to try. I'm not promising, but I'm going to try at least three videos a week. And I know that's um, saying a lot because I uh, know it's actually not. So I know people who are doing like five videos a week, but that's just that's not the kind of person I want to be. Like all due respect, I cannot work that much. I cannot. I need my time. I need my time with my husband and um, hats off to people who shoot five times a week and who upload five times a week. It's, it's really difficult. Um, but yeah, I had a fun time shooting this and I hope you guys had a fun time watching this. So do come back and yeah, like, comment, subscribe as you know on the YouTube land. I'll see you guys soon. Mwah.